All right. Hello. Good afternoon. Uh, well, good evening now, everybody. Can you hear me? Can everybody hear me? Yes, I can hear you. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, Susana Chacon, can you turn on your camera, please? Yes. Thank you, Jose Ilan. Also, can you turn on your camera? Buenas noches. Uh, okay, good. So we are here already. I'm guessing that um, I'm still waiting for some some of the students because I'm supposed to have 20, so I have 14 right now. Um, Jose Lam, can you hear me? I'm guessing he's having problems. Let's see the shot. We're waiting for five more. So, in the meantime, um, let me introduce myself. My name is Alcides Hernandez, and I'm going to be your teacher for this model. Um, this is um, basic or beginners, uh, model number three, correct? Is everybody in the correct uh, model? This is beginners, model number three. Yes. Good. Yes. Yes, it's model two. Okay, model number three. Good, good. Okay, as you can see, yes. model number three is going to, we're going to be talking about a lot of stuff. And uh, the first topic that we're going to be talking are months and dates. So that's, that's the one thing that we're going to be talking about today. Let's see here. I just okay, what I would like right now to, to start from um, is that I would like you to give a little bit, talk, to you, talk about you, a little bit of introduction. For example, my name is Alcides. My last name is Hernandez. I'm from San Miguel, but right now I'm living here in San Salvador, in Colonia Pro um, I'm 35 years old. Um, I'm an English teacher, and I have been teaching English for 15 years. Um, I have been working for a lot of companies, and now I'm here with English Corporativo. Um, in my free time, I like to cook. <laughs> Okay, so any yeah. questions? Okay, whenever I call your name, turn on your camera and do a little presentation like I did, okay? So let's see, let's start with Susana Chacon. Can you do your little introduction, please? Susana, Susana, can you hear me? Hello. Okay, Susana, can you turn um turn on your camera and do a little introduction, please? My name is Susana Chacon. Okay, what else? Susana, where, where are you from, Susana? I am from in La Palma, Chalatenango. I like Chalatenango. I used to work in Chalatenango. I used to live there for four years. Pretty cool. I like it. Okay. Um, what do you do, Susana? Uh, 
Perdón. Hola. What do you do? Do you, do you study or work? I am working in a bank. Okay, you work in a bank. Very good, very good. Okay, so let's see, Jose and Lang, can you hear me? Jose Lang? Hi, my name. Go, go, go. My name is Jose. Uh, last name Chicas. Uh, um, I have uh, 31 years old. Uh, I work. Let's see, I work in Popico. Uh, I live in San Salvador. Good. Okay, Jose, when, when you're talking about your age, you said, I am. I am 31 years old, okay? Okay, de acuerdo. Okay, I am 31 okay. years old. Very good. Okay, let's listen to Adelaida, please. Can you do a little introduction, please? Hello. My name is Adelaida and my last name is Funes. I am 32 years old. I'm living in San Miguel and I work with World Vision El Salvador. And that's it. Thank you very much. Okay, so you are in San Miguel right now? No, not yet. Right now I I am in Chapeltique. Oh, okay, I know Chapeltique. You but know? it's San Miguel. Yeah, I, I'm, I'm from San Miguel. I live, yes. um, actually, my house is in, over there, in, where is it? In Barrio La Merced. I live in Barrio La Merced, San Miguel. By, by uh -huh. Estadio Charlet. Ah, yeah, I know this, Good. this that's, place. That's my house, but, um, but I'm living here in San Salvador right now. Thank you. Okay, okay thank you. let's see. Angel Sarabia, can you do a little presentation, please? Hi everybody, uh, my name is Angel Sarabia. I am a, a live in, in Antiguo Cojatlán. I, I work in Banco Promerica. And this is all. Okay, I live in Antiguo Cojatlán. Live is like in, in vivo, but live, vivir. Okay? I live okay. in Antiguo Cojatlán. Very good. Thank you. Okay, thank you, thank you. Okay, let's see, uh, Carlos Alvaro. Carlos Alvaro, a, a little bit of introduction, please. Carlos, what is it? Alvarado, right? Hi, Alvarado. Hi, Alvarado. Okay. Uh, my name is Carlos Alvarado. I hope in Banco Promerica. Yes, I. Okay, este, I am 36 whole years. Live in Mexicanos. Oh, you live in Mexicanos. Very good. Okay. Good. Thank you very much. Um, let's see okay. who's next. Daniel Perdomo. Daniel, can you do a little presentation, please? Good night, everybody. Good night. Good night. I am Daniel Perdomo. My, my name is Daniel Perdomo. I live in Apopa. I work at Compañía Salvadoreña Teleservices. Thank you very much. Let's see. That's it. Daisy Racinos, can you do a little presentation, please? Good evening. Good evening, partners. 
Uh, my name is Daisy. Uh, my last name uh, Resinos. I am manager in Acasecal. Is on is uh, I am forty five. I live in I live in. in Soy a pango. Good. Um, nice to meet you. Oh, nice meeting you too. Thank you very much. Okay, let's see who's next. Alexa. Thank Medrano. you. Alexa. 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 Is that correct? Good. good yes. Uh, good evening, teacher. Uh, good evening. Uh, good night, everybody. My name is Giovanni Medrano. Uh, I live in San Miguel. I work in a bank. I am 33 years old. Good. Thank you very much. Okay, so you are right now in San Miguel, right? Yes. Okay, very good, very good. Nice, nice to meet you. Let's see who's next, Ever Ayala. Uh, good night. <laughs> Um, my name is Ever. My last name is Ayala. I'm from La Palma, Chalatenango. I am work in a bank. Good. I, I see that a lot of you, your classmates, are, are working in a bank. Very good. That's good. Um, let's see who's next. Gladys Hernandez. Hello. Hello. Good night. Uh, my name is Gladys. Last name is Hernandez. I live in Cesori. I work in World Vision. Um, I am 39 years old. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Very good. Very good. Okay, so let's see who's next. Carla Cano. Good night. Hello. My name is Carla Cano. I live in Sayapango. I work for in, in a restaurant I'm and manager. And I, I am 29 years old. Hey, nice to meet you, everybody. Thank you very much. Very much. Nice to meet you, too. Let's see who's next. Um, Frank Lopez. Frank, can you do a little bit of introduction, please? Okay, maybe he's having trouble with this. Um, let's see, Ninet Barraza. Can you do a little introduction, please, Ninette? Ninette, can you hear me? Alguien tiene mucha interferencia, se escucha un bajo ahí como de una música o algo, no sé quién será, pero eso interrumpe con el audio. Let me check. Let me turn off all things here. Okay, now. Good, good, thanks. Good. Um, so, Ninet, can you hear me? Okay, let's see Gamaliel. Gamaliel, is that correct? Yes. Okay. Hi. You, hello. Can you do a little introduction, please? Yes. Uh, hi. My name is My name is David. My last name is Perez. I am 38 years old. I live in San Salvador, and I am teacher of PE. Physical education. Yes. Good. Good. Nice. 
Okay, is anybody else who hasn't, uh, or Carla Torrento, who's, where is Carla Torrento? Hi, good night. Hello, Hello good, good night, evening. Sure. Um, my name is Carla Torrento. I live in Santana City. I work in one link is um, contact center. It's a nice to meet you. Nice meeting you too. Okay, good. Thank you very much. Okay, as I said, teacher, you know, yes, excuse me. Yeah. Uh, uh, can you let me, uh, sorry, what's your name? Yeah, my name is Alcides Hernandez. Alcides, Alcides Hernandez, yes. Thanks. Yes, but you know, my, my friends and everybody, call, they call me Tony, you know. So you can call me Tony too, don't worry. Uh, okay. Anyone has a question right now? No, okay, let's move on then. So what we're going to do right now is that I'm going to share a screen of the things that we're going to be talking about today. Let me go here. Let's see. Just give me a minute. Okay, I prepared something for you guys. So we're going to start with numbers. I hope you you remember numbers, okay? So because we're going to check. It. You already you already seen numbers on um, model number one, I guess. So today we're going to check them out. Okay, so I'm going to share with you my screen. Okay, if sometime during the presentation, if you have any questions, let me know so I can help you out, okay? Also, I'm going to, um, to turn on that caption so you can see what I'm, what I'm saying, okay? Okay, so this is the beginners model number three. Today is Monday, June 1st, 2020. My name, as I said, is Alcides Hernandez, or you can call me Tony, okay? This is my information. If you can, or if you want, you can actually um, write down my, my information. If you have any question later after the class, you can write me down and I can answer to you very, you know, as soon as possible. So everybody can see this, um, this screen? Yes. Good. Thank you. Thank you. By any if for some reason you don't you don't see or have some problems, let me know. Okay, so I can see if I can fix it. Okay, Angel Saraya, can you hear me? Yes, I hear you. Thank you very much. I'm just checking because I see you here, but your microphone your micro your microphone is off. Okay, let's begin. Okay, these are the rules for the virtual classroom. Uh, can everybody read the, the, the rules, please? Okay, loading on time. Thank you. Be restful, uh, restful at all time. Do you work? Uh, participate a lot. Follow instructions. Instructions, uh, speak or upload. Good. So number one, log in on time. Be respectful at all times. Do your work, participate a lot. Follow instructions and uh, speak out loud. Any questions, which one uh, you don't understand here? Any questions here? No questions. No question, teacher. There we go. Okay, good, let's see, let's move on. Okay, so as I said, the very 
very first thing that we need to check is your numbers. Um, does, does everybody want a, knows the numbers up to one, one to 50, let's say. Do you know the numbers one to 50? Yes. Good. Um, so at the count of three, I want to hear everybody uh, saying the numbers from one to 10, okay? If not, I'm going to ask you one by one, and that's gonna take us a lot of time. So at the count of three, everybody saying that the numbers from one to 10. One, two, three, go. Oh. Two. One. 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 Two. Three. Two. Three. Four. Five. Very good. So no problem. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, 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 nine, ten. Very good. Okay, so I see you have one uh one, one, two, ten. Let's go. Let's continue. So, the achievement indicator right now is to identify, discuss, and talk about numbers. Let's see here. Please silent your TV. Okay, if somebody has the TV on, or let me just do it here. I can actually use it. There you go. Okay, so let's move on. And I have this little introduction. Okay, I need two participants to do this a little introduction. Two participants, let me know, please. Hi. Hi, Hugo. Yes, go. It's good, teacher? Yes. Okay. Hi, Hugo. What, what is you going on this Monday? This what you did national broadcast last night. Pretty good. Hey, hello, Alvaro. Nothing going on this Monday. Yeah, I be I watched uh, the national broadcast last night. What about you? No, I could not. I had so many things to do. Do you know what we are going to learn today? Yes, I know. We are going to learn too. Successfully? Successfully uh, identify, discuss, uh, and talk about numbers. Very good, very good, nice. So listen, hi you, what's, what's going on this Monday? Did you watch the national broadcast last night? Hey, hello, Alvaro, nothing going on this Monday. Yeah, I watched the national broadcast last night. What about you? No, I couldn't, I have so many things to do. Do you know what we're going to learn today? Yes, I know. We are going to learn to successfully identify, discuss, and talk about numbers. Pretty good. Okay, let's move on. This is a little introduction I like to do every, every time I start a class, okay? Okay. Uh, can somebody read this, please? Me, teacher. Go. There are two main types of numbers. Cardinal numbers. One, two, etc. You said mainly for coding e ordinal numbers, uh, first, second. You said mainly for print, dint, and sentence, sequence. Sequence, very good. 
Okay, so it says here, there are two main types of numbers. Cardinal numbers, one, two, etc. Used mainly for counting. And then we have ordinal numbers. First, second, etc. Used mainly for putting things in a sequence. So that means, you know, after another. Okay, uh, who can read this, please? Somebody else. Cardinal numbers are normally used when you count I have two brothers, the the one days in January. Did you add then fifty three years old? Next to this twenty six years old. You do the telephone number on phone number is two six three. May 7, Jerry Suan Bowl 1975, and American Wrestling for the 1492. Okay, good. So, cardinal numbers, he says, cardinal numbers are normally used when you count things. I have two brothers. There are 31 days in January. Give your age. I'm 33 years old. My sister is 27 years old. Give your telephone number. Our phone number is 263-3847. Give years. She was born in 1975. America was discovered in 1492. So this is cardinal numbers. How, how do we use this? Okay. Can somebody else read this, please? Anybody else? Me. Oh, oh, thank you. Now, this is how we divide the year into two parts. Huh? This is the form for year up to 1999, for the year 2001. And on, we say 2000, 2001, 2002. Etc. Very good, very good. So notice how we divide the year in two parts. This is the form for year up to 1999. For the year 2000 and on, we say 2000, 2001, 2002, etc. Okay. Do you guys know what is the meaning of notice? What is the meaning of this word? Anybody? So notice means like uh, like check it out or in Spanish it would be like noten. Okay, moving on. Okay, everybody reading please or somebody else. Rigoberto Nieto, can can you read this please? Okay, uh, you can normally create, sorry, create ordinary yes. numbers by ending and a cardinal numbers. Ordinal numbers are normally used when you give a day 27 of January. 27 of January. Thing in a sequence or order. Liverpool come second in the football language last year. Give the floor of a building. This office in is on the then floor. Half birthdays. He have a good party for this 24th birthday. Refer to centuries Shakespeare. Shakespeare was born in the 66th century. Century. Very good. Okay, 
You can normally create ordinal numbers by adding th to the end of a cardinal number. Ordinal numbers are normally used when you give a date. My birthday is on the 27th of January, 27th of January. Put things in a sequence or order. Liverpool came second in the football league last year. Get the floor of a building. His office is on the, on the 10th floor. How birthdays? He had a huge party for his 21st birthday. Refer to two centuries. Shakespeare was born in the 16th century. Okay, any questions about here? Like, for example, any vocabulary that you don't know? Repeat, please. Do you have any questions about vocabulary? Maybe a word that you don't know here? So everything is understood? Understood. Okay, good. Let's move on. Okay, let's see if we can do the reading. Ever Ayala, can you do that reading, please? Okay. <laughs> For the name of a king or queen in wording English, Roman numerals are used Henry eight, uh, eight but in in spoken English, you will say Henry the Egg. Thank you. Okay, as you can see, for the name of a king or queen in written, written English, Roman numerals are used. So Henry the Eighth. But in spoken English, you would say Henry the Eighth. So it's this number. So these are Roman numbers, okay? Questions? No, teacher. Good, thank you very much. Okay, here we go. Uh, we already did uh, from to 10. So let's move on to 11 to 20. Listen to me first. 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. Now, everybody reading, please. 10, 11, 11, 11 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. 18, 19, 19, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25. It was, it was up to 20. Sorry, sorry, 20, 20. Okay, so now we continue from 20 to 30. So listen, 21, 22, 23, 24, 24, 24, 24, 24, 24, 24, 24, 24, 24, 24, 24, 24, 24, 24, 24, 24, 24, 24, 24, 24, 24, 24, 24, 24, 24, 24, 24, 24, 24, 24, 24, 24, 24, 24, 24, 24, 24, 24, 24, 24, 24, 24, 24, 24, 24, 24, 24, 24, 24, 24, 24, 24, 24, 24, 24, 24, 24, 24, 24, 24, 24, 24, 24, 24, 24, 24, 24, 24, 24, 24, 24, 24, 24, 24, 24, 24, 24, 24, 24, 24, 24, 24, 24, 24, 24, 24, 24, 24, 24, 24, 24, 24, 24, 24, 24, 24, 24, 24, 24, 24, 24, 24, 24, 24, 24, 24, 24, 24, 24, 24, 24, 24, Okay, 30. And 31. 31. 31. 31. 31. 31. 32. 32. 34. 35. 37. 38. 39. 39. Very good. So we say 31, 32, 33, 34, 35, 36, 37, 38, 39. Very good. Well, let's go here. 40. 40. 40. 40. 40. 50. 50. 50. No, no, wait, 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 wait. Listen, listen, listen to the number first. Listen, seven, fifty-eight. Hey, mama, please. <laughs> okay, that that the pronunciation for fifty. Fifty. Don't say fifteen because that that is different. Okay. Fifty. 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 50. 50. 50. 50. 50. 
Fifty. This is like double F. Fifty. Don't put, don't, don't put 10 at the end. It's only 60. 60. 60. Okay. 60. Now let's go. 61. 61. 62. 70. Okay, 69. 69. 79. 79. 79. 79. 79. 79. 79. 79. 79. 79. 79. 81 one hundred. 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 From here, you can say 70, 70, 80, 80, 90, 90, 90, 90, and this one is 100, 100, 100. or you can say 100, 100, 100, 100. thanks. Okay, any questions about the numbers? No. Okay, oh, so you're, you're good on one to one hundred. That's good. Very good. Moving on. I have a question for you. Okay, yes. Eighty or ninety? Ninety. It, this one. It's, yes, it's ninety. 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 It's like 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 with the word n. Ninety. 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 For example, this one look ninety nine. Ninety nine. Ninety nine. Good. Lo quisiera decir noventa. If you ninety, that's it. Ninety. Ninety. But if you can say diecinueve, is nineteen. So you see the difference? Diecinueve, nineteen, noventa, ninety. It's very yeah. different. The same ninety. Good. Ninety. Eighty. Any other question? No. Very good. Moving on then. 
Okay, so we'll go with ordinal numbers because we're going to talk about dates. Okay, so uh, can somebody uh, read this, please? Rigoberto, can you read this, please? Roberto? Okay, Christy. Okay. Oh, okay, Roberto. Go, go. Okay. Can you normally create ordinal number by ending to the end of the a cardinal number? Ordinal numbers are normally used when you give a day. My birthday is on the 27th of February, 27 of February. Put in is a sequence. Sequence. Sequence or order. Liverpool come second in the football language. Let's do. Give the floor of a building. This office is up on the damn floor. A building. They have a whole party for this 21st birthday. To centuries, Shakespeare was born in the 16th century. Good, thank you very much. So, as you can see, uh, the th means that um, ordinal, 27th. So at the end, you say like the th, you, you use like, like, like a little bit of sound, 27th. Okay. Uh, and this one is Li. Uh, I heard that some people are saying language. It's not language, it's Li. Okay, moving on. Okay, so here are the uh, ordinal numbers, the cardinal numbers. So we say first, second, third, fourth, fifth, sixth, seventh, eighth, ninth, tenth. Everybody? First, uh, first second, you do a little sound like you're trying to blow. Hacen el sonido al final como que quieren soplar. Okay. And, and this one, uh, somebody say second. No, no second. It's second. 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 This one is third. 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 Very good. Third. So let's do it together. Third. First. 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 Second. 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 Third. Second. Third. 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 Fourth. 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 Okay, this one I'm going to do it first and then you do it after me, okay? Okay, let's do it. Eleventh, 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 twelfth. 12, 20 Okay, remember that this one, that th, you have to sound like you, you want to blow, like you want to make a sound. Okay, so you say 20th. 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 
Okay. Now listen to me one more time. Just listen. Don't repeat. Eleventh. Eleven. Thirteen. Thirteen. Fourteen. Fifteen. Sixteen. Sixteen. Seventeen. 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 Eighteen. Eighteen. Nineteen. 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 Twentieth. 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 Okay, good. Moving on. Let's go with this one. Let's move on to twenty-first. Twenty-first. Twenty-second. 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 Twenty-third. Wait, 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 wait. Somebody is saying twenty-second. No, it's not 22nd. 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 28, 28, 28, 29, 29, 30th, 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 31st, 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 41st, 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 the number zero, everybody. Ready, please. The number zero, we normally say zero for the number zero. But when we give uh, our telephone number, we often say a zero like a uh, name of the letter zero. Oh, wait, he no. Is is we, we, we often say O, like the name of the letter O. So we don't okay. say zero. When we give the telephone number, we say O. For example, oh. 505, then O to 3. Okay? 505, 1, O, 2, 3. Good. So that's it. When we're giving phone numbers only. So we don't say zero, we say O. Okay? Wow. Okay. okay. Very good. Any questions so far? No, no questions. Sure. Very good. Thank you. Okay. Um, let's see who's going to read. Uh, Christy, can you read this, please? Christy, can you read this? No, Christy. Teacher, one question. Yes. Uh, uh, can I pronunciation un cuarto? Uh, a quarter. A quarter. A quarter. A quarter. Yes. Okay, no, Christy. No, eh. Can you, can you read this for us, please? What is that for a quarter? You can you can say a quarter or a third or a fourth. A fraction. Three to the fourth. Uh, two. Uh, you say uh, two and three. Two and three. This is my phone and another comma. Two and five. Two and, and a half. Two and a half. Two point yes. five. Is there five, more yes. than one number of the decimal point? Two 
this guy is number in Google. Google value uh, 3,400. The section to this row is when we are talking about the loss and tens. The phone tens. Very good, very good. Okay, so he says, notice that for, let me just put here, okay, just listen to this. Notice that for one, 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 four, you can say a quarter or four. If we have a whole number with a fraction, we use the word n between the two parts. Example, two, three, five equals two and a three fifth. For parts of whole numbers, we use decimal points and not, not a comma. For example, two, one, two, two and a half, or equals 2.5. If there is more than one number after the decimal point, we say each number individual. For example, 3,456 points 789. Okay. The exception to this rule is when we're talking about dollars and cents or pounds in tens. Example 2195. $21.99 cents. Saying the word cents at the end is option. Okay. Any questions here? No. Okay, we're good. Okay, so we finish with the presentation, numbers, cardinals, and ordinals. So let me just check something here. Okay, for this specific um, class, we're going to check this video. Months and dates. Okay, everybody's watching what I'm doing, right? You can see my 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 my, my screen, right? Yeah. Thank you very much. Okay, here it is. This is what we, what we need to watch. Pay attention, everybody. I don't hear the video teacher. Okay, wait, wait, wait. You can listen to the video? Uh, I, I, I don't hear this. Okay, I let, see the video, me. I know hear video. Okay, let me fix it, let me fix it. Don't worry, don't worry. Let me do something here. In the option for shame scream. Yes, 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 yes. I got it. Some... Now you can hear? And dates. Additionally, yes. you learn about work dates. Thank you. Let's much. get started by listening and practicing the months and dates. Practice the months and the dates. Months. January. February. March. April, May, June, July, August, September, October, November, December. Dates. First, second, third, fourth, fifth. Sixth, seventh, eighth, ninth, tenth, eleventh, twelfth, thirteenth, fourteenth, fifteenth, sixteenth, seventeenth, eighteenth, nineteenth. 20th, 21st, 22nd, 23rd, 
24th, 25th, 26th, 27th, 28th, 29th, 30th, 31st. Now let's learn how to talk about your birthday. The question is, when is your birthday? My birthday is on April 5th. To express birthdays or to express any particular date, we can follow this next formula. That's special day plus the verb to be plus the preposition on plus month plus the date. Let's put that formula into practice. My birthday is on April 5th. The special day is my birthday. Then we include the birth to be is. After that, we need to add the preposition on. Next, we add the month April. Uh, finally, we include the date 5th. Let me give one more example. When is Independence Day in the US? Independence Day is on July 4th. The uh, special day is Independence Day then we include the verb to be is. After that, we need to add the preposition on. Next, we add the month July. And finally, we include the date, 4th. Now it's your turn to practice by expressing the special days or holidays from your country. For example, New Year's Day, Valentine's Day, Independence Day or Christmas. After you finish this task, share your work in our discussion forum. Good. Um, did everybody see the, the video? Yeah, I see. Yes. Yes. Good. So we were yeah. talking about uh, months. Okay, months. The number one, January. Everybody. January. 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 February. 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 March. 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 April. 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 April, May, 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 June, 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 June. Wait, wait, wait. Somebody is saying John. John is a person. June, 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 July, 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 August. August, 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 September, 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 October, 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 November, 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 December, 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 December. Do you remember the question uh, about the birthday? Do you remember how to do the question? Yes. No. I remember. I remember the question. Okay, can you do that question? When is your birthday? When is your birthday? Very good. Everybody, when is, when is your birthday? Everybody, when is your birthday? Can you repeat? When, when is your birthday? birthday? Birthday. 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 And when you when you answer, you say my birthday is on. 
my birthday is on and then the my month and the date. On. My birthday is on. My birthday is on. My birthday is on. My birthday is on. My birthday, my birthday, birthday is, is on. on. Okay, now say that, that, that the month. The month and the day. For example, me. My birthday is on September 15th. Now you do it, everybody. My, my birthday, birthday is on, birthday on, on September. Okay, very my good. My birthday Day is on Day May 26th. Okay, guys, uh, we finished the class. Uh, that was all for today. Um, I hope you uh, review it. And when we come back tomorrow, I'm going to make some questions using the, the, the dates and the numbers, okay? Okay. okay. Hey. Okay. If you have any questions, please use my information that I showed before, okay? Okay, teacher. Thank you. Okay, teacher. Okay. Have a nice night, and yes. I'll see you tomorrow. Have a nice Thank you. Good Bye. 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 Bye.